Hello, my name is Susan Abelo Okae and I am the project manager for Love Binti here in Uganda. I've been working with Love Binti for the past three years and it is really amazing and fulfilling working with the women. I started working with women and girls way back at my tender age when I was still a teenager. I had the desire to see dreams and goals of girls and women accomplished. I was born in the slums of Chibuli. I usually call myself a slum girl. So I saw all the needs of the girls and women in the community. I saw how my mother struggled to give us a better life. And for me, that was my inspiration to work with women and girls. At a very tender age, I started um, supporting some other girls with scholastic materials. At a tender age, I would mobilize for resources to train women in different economic empowerment skills like candle making and, and basket weaving and stuff like that. And for me, this has been my dream. I mean, I am running my passion, I am doing my passion. And this has really been very, very important for me. As the Uganda Project Manager for Love Binti, I am in charge of the Women Empowerment Project and the Menstrual Health and Hygiene Project of, of girls and women in Uganda. At the, at the empowerment centers, we train women, on, uh, we skill them on tailoring, we empower them with entrepreneurship skills for self-sustainers, we teach them about reproductive health, we teach them about menstrual hygiene. We also go out to communities and train girls in schools, in rural communities, about menstrual health and hygiene. It is a very challenging situation here in Uganda. So many girls have no access to proper menstrual, menstrual kits. So you find that a girl possibly misses out of school or uh, gets infections because of poor menstrual health hygiene habits. So as Love Binti, we go out to communities and tell these girls, hey, this is how you keep your pads clean. You can ma actually make your own pad if you cannot afford one. And for us, this is really fulfilling. So far, we have trained over 77, 770,000 girls in menstrual hygiene different communities, rural communities, up on Karamoja Mountains, down in the valleys of, of Kasese. I mean, we've, we've gone so many places to train these girls on how they can better equip themselves via menstrual hygiene. And also skilling them, how they can be able to make money through tailoring, fashion and design. And I am happy every time I hear feedback, oh, there is a, a girl an alumni from our training center, she has her own sewing machine and she's doing this at, at Lab Beauty. We feel fulfilled and that is it. That is our goal, to empower women to be financially independent, to empower women to know about their health and we are doing it. Thank you Love Beauty.